is up guys, I'm Tom and FC Heaven back in the house with the brand new Liverpool episode. We have Aston Villa and in Aston Villa in the FA Cup. Let's go. So far we always went out at this stage of the FA Cup, so hopefully we can change that and go far in the competition. I really want to get to Wembley because it's such an amazing stadium and the FA Cup is the oldest cup competition in the whole world of football and uh, they have Darren Bent on the bench, Kozak uh, up front, which is really interesting. I think they sold, no it's Weiman up front, that's weird. They sold Benteke, I think... Uh, and I'm not sure if it's Chelsea or or somebody else. But this is our strongest lineup at the moment. I play Marquinhos instead of Agar to give him some playing time. Let's go! Go on, Sturridge. Coutinho! Finish! Sterling! No! Oh, lucky. No fucking way, man. Kozak, what a great start for Aston Villa. An over-the-top through ball. I just couldn't deal with that. And even though I brought out Mignole to close the angle, Kozak, after a nice first touch, slots it home. No. Whoa! What a shot that was. Sturridge! Yes! Daniel! Yes! Daniel Sturridge makes it 1-1. Oh, that's a great turn, Sturridge. Brilliant. I can't believe it. Another over-the-top through ball that I can't deal with. Please! Please! No way! What the fuck is going on, man? No. No, 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 no way! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Mignole is straight to Kozak who makes it 3-1. This is him. Wow. I'm yeah, I'm I'm speechless guys. No ref, no way. That's a yellow and the sec Wow. EA doesn't like me today at all. That's just... Oh my word. Sturridge! Yes! Come on, pick the ball up. Oh my word, I can't believe we lost this game. Basically, Aston Villa scored all their chances, I think. <sighs> They really outplayed us here, so I hold my hands up. We are out of the FA Cup once again, even though I wanted to get at least to the semi-finals to Wembley. Absolutely got it. Give a like, leave a like on the video to make me feel better, guys, because this was just, wow, terrible game for us. I'm still absolutely gobsmacked that we are out of the FA Cup once again. And I just want to see how many red cards did we get this season. Marquinhos already has two red cards. Uh, by the way, you guys want uh, to see squad reports every month. So here it is. Varan has one red card already. This is the season of the red cards. I, d I don't understand why Sterling has a red card as well. Oh, wow, look at those stats by Pogba. Absolutely insane. And uh, Draxler has 10 assists already. Coutinho has 15. And Coutinho has a red card as well. He just picked it up against uh, Aston Villa in the FA Cup. 
just absolutely astonishing how we were totally out outplayed by a mid-table team. Bakali has a red card as well. It's just... Yeah, I know my tackling is sometimes harsh, but some of the red cards were so undeserved. Wow. I really hope that on next gen I can do better in the FA Cup. Um, because uh, I'm really disappointed that we couldn't get uh, anywhere near to the semi-finals in the FA Cup. Usually we go out in the last 16 or the last 32 stage, which is very, very disappointing. But we still have the league and the Champions League to play for. Agger has two red cards as well. What the hell, man? Yeah, maybe I'm just playing like a dirty, dirty boy. <laughs> In this season, I don't know what it is, but some of the red cards were really, really harsh. Especially like the Coutinho red card. So yeah, we are out of the FA Cup. I'm really sorry that I couldn't do better in the FA Cup, guys. But uh, in the next episode, which could be early tomorrow if you guys hit 150 likes or maybe 200 likes on this episode. In the next episode, we are playing Tottenham and then Swansea and then uh, Champions League round of 16 second leg and some friendly international games and then Chelsea. So the season is really hotting up. The best part is yet to come. Thanks for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. Just leave a like if you did. I really appreciate all your support. Tobal FC Army going strong. See you later, guys. Goodbye. Wow, guys. The St. James's Park, one of my favorite stadiums in the Premier League. And always between Newcastle and Liverpool, the two games are so tense. A lot of you guys said that you want a 100-minute 